Hi, and welcome back. I am Danilo Romolini, and today I brought you to Siena, one of the most spectacular and untouched areas of Tuscany. The property we will see today was in the past a military fortress, and today it's been partially restored and turned into a wonderful estate. It nearly has 1,000 years of history. Are you ready to see it? Come with me. The property is built on top of a hill on a series of terraces, and it is surrounded by roughly 99.6 hectares of land. Most of it is woodland. All around the garden, it is possible to find some ruins of the original fortress. Today, we have discovered already some underground passages and caves, but there are for sure many others to be found. Because of its dominant and strategic position on the valley, this castle has always been in the middle of battles. In fact, it's been partially destroyed, and today, looking at its shape, we think that originally it was shaped like an ellipse. We are now by the entrance gate. Let's go and see it. Have a look at this side of the castle. This is the main facade, but it is not where the castle originally would end. In fact, it would keep going all the way around following these walls and it would end down there at that wall that we'll see now. From this terrace, you can really appreciate the potential this castle had as a military fortress. In fact, the view from this terrace is incredible. From here, you even see Siena down there in the distance. Let's talk about the buildings of the estate. There is the castle, which is right behind me, 600 square meters, laid over four floors with six bedrooms and four bathrooms. Then there are several other buildings to be restored, two of which are right below the castle. There is a 200 square meters farmhouse, which also has room for expansion. And then last but not least, there is the private chapel, which is very spacious and has so much potential. Right below the castle, we find what was originally the entrance gate to the property. This is all guard from this original wall that you can notice all around, and the wall itself is guarded from some towers. This flat space on top of the hill is something really precious and special to have. In fact, this would be perfect to have a swimming pool area with the garden all around. Prima di entrare dentro al castello, vorrei farvi vedere questo piccolo appartamento completamente restaurato con una zona living e una cucina al piano terra e due camere e un bagno al primo piano. È perfetto per un ospite oppure per un custode. E ora venite con me e vi faccio vedere l'interno del castello. Walking inside, you realize how thick these walls are. In some parts, they're over a meter thick and they've been reinforced over the years after all of the battles that happened here. This is the entrance room and from here we access to a TV room on my right. The stairs to go upstairs 
and over there there is a bathroom and the kitchen they all have this original terracotta floor and these beautiful arches on the ceiling let's now pass through the steps and go upstairs We are now on the Piano Nobile of the castle. Passing through this door, we get to this huge living area with these really high ceilings that are probably even six meters high. This room also has these three big windows that give you a very dominant and spectacular view on the valley right below. From this room, you access to two bedrooms, one over there and another one on my right. Each one of them has its own ensuite bathroom. This is the last floor of the castle. We're now inside a reception area, completely paved in terracotta floor with wooden beams on the ceiling. From here, we access to a bathroom right in front of me and on my left to a bedroom. Let's now pass up these steps. This part of the last floor is currently used as a really spacious living area with its own fireplace. But since it is so spacious, it's really versatile and it could be turned either into a kitchen with living room creating an apartment on this top floor or into a really large suite now i want to bring you to the rooftop terrace of the castle passing through these steps check out this view it is really breathtaking and from up here you can also see this roof which has been fully restored with antique tiles this property is perfect for someone looking to retire in the quiet reserved green Tuscany or for someone that would like to restore all of the other buildings and turn this property into a boutique hotel. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Ciao!